throwing on. It's your boy, Ancient Poet. You know, about to go do a little church service. Um, but to, uh, come to talk about Summer Madness 7, uh, I really wanted to speak about this. Um, first, I want, first of all, I want to pay homage to all the battle rappers that are still relevant to this day, that are still doing their thing, um, that are still promoting, that are still bringing the good bars. That include Tay Rock. That include, um, you know, it used to be Chess, but Chess kind of fell off a little bit. It's kind of get a little level, you know, a little over the top as far as pride and all that stuff. He started messing up. And it could be his age. But to speak on Summer Madness 7 and all those who still holding it down, it was the worst of the worst, if you want to say, out of all the Summer Madness. It was still good as far as certain battles. Geechee Gotti to me, um, Shotgun Sugar, I'm saying. Again, um, was it Reed actually came fire and you know, uh, but T Rex, man, I was never a fan favorite, fan favorite of T Rex as far as you know, supporting him and liking his style, even though he's a legend in the game and he's been holding it down according to his style. But for this summer madness, for and seven, and for Rex not, not having to come out in a while, to be honest. He did pretty bad, I'm saying, my occasion. Reed actually came and showed you the 10-year wait was worth it on his side. T-Rex did bad. You know, all the other people, man. It, I mean, and also T-Rock. This is the real reason why I did this uh, video right here. And you're going to see a video right here speaking about it. I'm going to let y'all see it real quick. Get out of here. How dare you this one nigga say, get smacked the, smack the fuck out of here. Uh, if him, I was smack, I would've stepped uh, back like, you ain't getting your page up a half shun and get uh, your ass the fuck out of here. When he, when he battled this dude, when he said, when he said, uh, what was the line he said? He said, uh, if I was smack, if I was smack, I wouldn't page your other half. Get yourself the F out of here. But basically, I'm gonna let y'all see the line and y'all gonna understand it. Go. And then, um, that being said, yeah, and now I'm gonna let y'all see Smack's clip and see that actually it was a fulfillment of prophecy. And there's the goes the clip. Key and so that being that said, take to place so with you know, um, you know, Doc and Pay and what? Because um, I, I feel like I'm getting robbed without a gun right Smack now. Last night was it was, was definitely crazy, actually, like you know, not this with the choking, a, a, a couple Smack MCs choke, you know, but DNA. this the material uh, itself. When I was satisfied. Self f that out of here, and he said, and he re and rebuttaled it and said, um, if I was smack, I wouldn't page your other half. Now get your self the f out of here. I'm saying I don't want to curse for those viewers and those who watching YouTube. I'm saying for my video don't be pushed down, and plus I ain't much of a person that curse like that unless I have to. But yeah, that being said, though, I just wanted to comment on that. Summer Madness was not the best. Summer Madness this year. It was some battles that actually made up for the the bad the bad performance of, amongst a lot of battle rappers. But I just want to say to the battle rappers, man, I can't blame Smack because he only do what he can do in his power as far as payment, money, making sure y'all book, making sure y'all arrive on time and all that stuff. But yeah, he did kind of take it easy on y'all and that's why probably why y'all thought I could get away with certain things, but at the end of the day, you can't blame another grown man for another grown man coming, knowing that he getting paid for his performance and not performing. I know paying for a pay-per-view and knowing that type of performance, I would not want to see the next one. But I'm a I'm a supporter of the URL. I'm a supporter of battle rap for the fact that it's lyrical, it gets my mind thinking. It's not the average thing that people talk on the everyday basis. You know what I'm saying? That being said, people, man, stay tuned. Support Battle Rap is the only thing that's still linked to the actual streets. The real people uh, haven't got too commercial, which I don't want it to get. I went to the point where guys can still make their money. Guys can still, um, you know what I'm saying, perform. Guys still can get ahead in life. But at the same time, it's not too mainstream. They want it mainstream, but I think that's where guys going to mess up the most. That's where the hunger is going to leave. Anything mainstream leaves lose the hunger behind you know i'm saying and it leaves people us not able to connect with the actual 
artists is or the fans or the, you know what I'm saying? It, vice versa. All right, it's your boy, Ancient Poet. I'm tuning out. Gotta go give the most high some, some love this Sunday. Peace.